All right, let's go take some builds for a second. Con. All right. Oh gosh, I remember this old build, the Liberator. This was from a Fourth of July special I made a while back. It's a pretty bad build, though I have to say. I'm not gonna get rid of it just for nostalgia's sake. Let's uh, let's make this healing build though, like a maximum healing build. So we're gonna put Hope Guard at level five, and I guess this could sort of be a Leon Shield build. But if we're making it true max healing, we're also gonna put this one up, and then we're gonna put this one in there, and then lower this one. And then I guess we could put this card in there just for a little bit of cooldown reduction. And we'll call this healing. Sure. I just want to see. Hope Guard, what does that feel like combined with Rejuvenate? Alright, let's see. They got Geno, Strix, Octavia, Fernando, and Shaolin. Oh, I'm going to get so much more healing than the Fernando. So, so much more healing. This is going to be great, because he's only got a Geno's healing him. I've got a Ying, which is one of the better heal bots in the game. On top of all the Rejuvenate I'm about to have for my loadout. And keep in mind, I also get lifesteal from my loadout, and I also get passive healing when my shield is up too. And then the item rejuvenate on top of it. Ah, this will be this will be fun. <laughs> it wouldn't be a gold skin; it would be black skin. The color scheme for gold skins is gold and black. So you've got all the gold gilding, like you can see on his splash art right there. Like you can see all the gold gilding. That would remain the same. It'd probably be like a bit of a brighter gold, just to make it special. And then the red parts would be replaced with black. And it would look awesome. And then you see those blue crystals? Replace them with the white and purple color that they use for crystals. And it'd be great. It'd be awesome. Alright, let's see. Let's go Leon Shield again. Leon Shield, healing build, rejuvenate, boom. So when I do this, I've got 30% rejuvenate. And then the 15% from, or the 10% from this rejuvenate gets diminished. But I still think we're getting close to like 35% rejuvenate from this. Or something like that. Which is nuts. It's way better than rejuvenate 3. So this Ying, I wonder, let's see, what's 30% of 700? Let's see, 10% would be 70, so multiply that by 3, that's 210 extra healing. So I'd be getting 910 healing from Ying, from one right click. And then her illusions also probably do more than 100 per tick. Actually, it'd probably be over 910, because, yeah, they're a diminished rejuvenate item. This'll be fun! Um, last time you ever played as Grover? I've played a bit of Grover recently. I think, I don't remember. Have I done the Grover for the, uh, the healing quest yet? I don't know if I have. I'm going to put my shield up and let's see. How does this healing feel? I guess we'll never know because I'm already full health. <laughs> let's take a little bit of damage. There we go. There's some damage. And we're back up to full health. Oh, this healing feels good. Put up a shield. Yeah, we're getting 110 from each illusion. From each of those ticks. So that's like 700 healings. Almost. Here, let me give you a quick heal. Charles. What a lovely name. Or Chaos of Doom fame. Looked like Charles of Doom fame for a second. I'm gonna call you Charles now. Your name is Charles. Now let's do this. Oh, she's breaking down my shield though. She does not like that. Let's see. Ooh, Strix. Do some damage to him. Oh, Dredge, be careful. Oh, uh, Dredge, 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 Dredge! No, the battle shot didn't hit him. Oh, I'm sorry. Alright, I'm just gonna put my shield up. I'm gonna let Ying focus on healing the rest of the people. I'm just gonna chill out here on point. Oh, I'm getting shot in the back. Oh, my shield is dead. Oh, I'm gone. I'm gone. Ow. They can get Rejuvenate 3, though. There we go. What talent are you going? I'm going Leon's shield. Because freaking memes, dude. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's get back to the point. Genos, get off my point. You icky killer shark. We don't like killer sharks. Alright. Um, oh, chaos. No, chaos. Okay. Oh, let's see, where's the new point? Oh, it's up top there. I'm gonna battle shout, just dodge that, and we're gonna head up here. I'm just gonna put my shield up and cap. Careful, Buck. Careful, buddy. Whoop. Oh, he took my healer. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, bye, Fernando. Whoa. Oh, they're doing damage. Shield, protect me. Oh, my gosh. Are they getting Wrecker? They don't even have Wrecker yet. That was just... That was insane. Okay. Oh my gosh, the Ying ult. Wait, guys, do damage to me. Fernando, shoot me. Yes, Shaolin, do damage to me. Yes, 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 yes. No, they're not doing enough damage to me. I want to take damage so I can see how the Ying ult feels with my shield up. They're physically not doing damage to me. Come on. Strix, you suck. Get out of here. Oh no, I was late on the battle shot for my Ying. Oh, sorry. 
Ooh, Drea jolting from behind. Got that gentle, so he just walked into it. Well done. Alright, there's that. Chaos, or Charles, as I'm gonna call you now. There's your heal. What do you think the worst class in Paladins is? There's no such thing. Each class is pretty important. I guess, I mean, if, if you really had to make me decide, I would say probably flanks. Because they're just like damage champions, but it's different. But I guess damage and flanks are sort of pretty much similar. I mean, damage champions are less mobile, but more damage. Flanks are also pretty hefty damage, but they're more mobile. I don't know. But you need damage champions, you need tanks, you need supports, you need all of it. So... Hey, yo, Strix. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's going this way. He's going this way. He's going this way, team. Get him. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no, I'm being ulted by Octavia. Oh, no, you don't have your movement ability, Octavia. <laughs> Bye. There we go. I was a bit delayed because I think she used her uh, her passive to just kind of stay still in midair for a second. But she's still gone. Okay. Um, let's see. Yeah, we're doing really good so far. I need to get down there and get to that capture point. So we're just going to chill out down here. Get my team some points. There we go. I'm helping. Let's take a drink. Ah. Mm. Yo, it's good, Fernando. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no. No, where's my ying? Ying. Ying, buddy. Ying. 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 Uh! Oh, my shield's almost dead. Okay, thank you, Buck. He just came in here and saved my life. Tiberius, too, really helpful. Right. Oh, there goes my shield. Crap. I don't got my extra rejuvenate now. What am I gonna do? Alright, here's a heal. Uh oh. Dodge it! Dodge it! There we go. I'm gonna hold my shield up here and just block damage if I can. You know, Khan's shield is really small, but in this tight hallway, it's still really helpful. Alright, let's move up to the new capture point now. Up we go. Flanks are used to kill the healer and the DPS and then help the tank. Yep. Although sometimes they can play a little bit like a backline DPS if they need to, too. Like Bora. She can easily play as a backline DPS for a few seconds if she needs. But, yeah, I guess in general, they are, they're, they're kind of there to finish off the people who the damage champions do damage to, and also go after healers and stuff like that. But, like, I don't know, I feel like most of the time, you could replace the damage champions on your team with flanks, and you could replace the flanks with damage champions, and you'd still probably be fine. Yeah. Yep. Let's just, uh, let's chill out here. I'm revealed. Oh, no. Hi, Strix. Ah, that's fun. I'm gonna take another sip. Yeah. No, no, Chad. I'm out of coffee. <laughs> that sucks. Ah. Man, the arm shield is pretty fun talent. Just, oh, I'm actually getting shot. All right, fine. I'll do a little bit of stuff. There we go. I'll help kill Genos. There we go. <laughs> yeah. right, there's a heal or something. I'm gonna just put up my shield. Oh, Octavia's ulting again. Oh no, she nuked my shield! Oh crap. Oh no, 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 no. Alright, Octavia, you gotta die for that. I can't have you destroy my shield. Mm. Mm, no. Crap. Alright. Um. Let's, see, let's get Haven 3. What else can I even get? I guess Cauterize. Sure. Why not? We're gonna win anyways, so I don't think it really matters. Oh, hello, Octavia. You like dying? There we go. Let's get you out of here. Let's get you out of here. I'm gonna camp the edge. Hey, Fernander! How are you? Bye-bye. Uh. Alright. Um, oh, I can't take on both these guys by myself. Run away. Alright. Also, Strix is over here, by the way. Watch out, team. There we go. He won. Nice. No GG. Alright, cool. <clears throat> Andrew says flanks are bad. Also, said Andrew gets 50 kills as Buck. Now, I'm not saying the flank class is, like, useless. I'm saying it's pretty... Like, you, you can't really say that a class is useless. Well, that was the most if I were relaxed to say class, I've seen useless. you play Paladins. Lola, lol. Also, <laughs> I'm off of work. Pop Yay! Is. No more work. Also, thanks for another 100 bits. I appreciate it. Alright, let's see how we do...
Yay, I stood on point a lot. Wow. Leon Shield Khan with a max heal build, ladies and gentlemen. That was pretty boring. I'm not going to do that again. We only need one more game to get to level 50, though. Theoretically. I mean, if we get like 220,000 XP, roughly, we'll be level 50. So this is the final game before we get the gold skin. Anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you have, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss an upload from me. Also, check out my Twitch channel linked in the description. I stream a bunch of Paladin's content there regularly, and that's where this stream highlight came from. So yeah, make sure you follow me there so you don't miss out on any streams in the future. Also, check out the Discord server linked in the description. We have a wonderful community with a bunch of active people, so go check it out. And lastly, I want to give a huge shout out to members of the channel for helping to support what I do. If you want to help support the channel and unlock some cool new emojis and an exclusive role in the Discord server, then just click the button right next to the subscribe button. Anyways, I will see you all next time. Peace out.